everybody, G loves trains here and guess what? I finally made it down south because today I am going for my first ever and probably last ever ride on a HST. We're going to be travelling with East Midlands Railway starting here at London St Pancras International and ending at Nottingham. I've got myself an advanced single first class ticket so I can flip between standard class and first class along the way. I am buzzing. Let's go get on the train shall we? Just making my way to the platform now and London St Pancras International. I am loving it here. Do you know why? It looks like an airport. Now here's the moment I've been most lucky forward to. Give it these slab doors I go. I've never done one of these before. Let's see if I can do it. We've opened it. Uh -huh. Now I'm expecting a decent slam from this. <laughs> Satisfiable. <laughs> The Intercity 125 trains consist of several Mark III coaches sandwiched between two Class 43 diesel locomotives. Today I shall be pulled by 43 272 and trailed by 43 309. The journey from St Pancras to Nottingham is scheduled to take 1 hour 38 minutes, with the train reaching a maximum speed of 110 miles per hour. I began my ride in standard class. <laughs> Just departing St Pancras now. Way we're off. You were what I need, don't you understand? We were made to fall in love. Uh, give me what I ask, let me hold your hand. Standard class seating is laid out in a two by two configuration with the odd few table seats. There is overhead luggage space, luggage racks, power sockets and screens that read EMR throughout the journey. After spending just over 20 minutes in standard class, I think it's about time I got myself into first class. The main difference between first and standard class is the seats. Yep, first class will see you relaxing in reclinable leather seats. First class seating is laid out in a 2 by one configuration, with tables everywhere. We're just coming into our first stop, Market Arbor. On this train I counted 6 coaches, 4 standard class and 2 first class with a buffet area in between both classes, but this was unfortunately closed. They are coming down with a trolley service here, a lovely member of staff as well. But um, I didn't realise they were offering food and drink, so I did bring a picnic. <laughs> and after food, there was only one place to go. <laughs> the toilet! From what I could tell from my walkthrough, toilets are located at both ends of the coaches, so you'll never be desperate for long. There's a slam door in the toilet too. <laughs> that made me jump. Give it to me. Give it to me. Just do it again. 
I'm smiling, I'm smiling. As small as the door gap is, it is very, very clean in this toilet. I'm liking this. Oh, we're now just going in to Leicester. So chuffed to be traveling on a high speed train. One reason being, I get to do this. The HST Hokey Cokey. Let's get it going, guys. Baby, you just have to know. for Wi-Fi. Oh yes, there is indeed onboard Wi-Fi. And it works! Get in there! Not that I need it, because I'm too busy watching the East Midlands speed by. We're at the penultimate stop, East Midlands Parkway. Pulling into Nottingham now, which unfortunately means it's time to get off. But before I can do that, I need to figure out how to open the door. Gentlemen, the train is now approaching Nottingham, Nottingham Station, our final calling point for our service. Uh, passengers, all change, all change, please. Okay, so we wait until this says door unlocked, and then we pull the window down. That is friggin' heavy. That's really heavy. And then, oh. Watch this, watch this, watch this. Oh my days, and I just opened the door. <gasps> Entering service in 1976, the HSTs are held close to the hearts of many train enthusiasts. The Class 43 is the fastest diesel loco in the world, with 43102 setting the record of 148 miles per hour back in 1987. Oh, I remember it so, uh, wait, I wasn't born. But they only run up to 125 miles per hour when in service. As it was just £4.95 extra, it sure was worth going in first class. I was determined to try out the HST experience for myself as due to the lack of compliance with accessibility regulations, EMR are retiring these trains on the 15th of May, 2021. a lot of firsts for me today. First time at London St Pancras International, first HST, first slam door shenanigans, first first class ride, first time in Nottingham. People may say the HSTs are old and outdated but I'd say they're clean and comfy. I have absolutely loved that. Thank you very much for watching everyone. Bye-bye.